You are watching 15 minutes with 15 images from Mars. Welcome to 15 minutes with 15 images from Mars. We are starting with the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter today. And this is a great image. NASA has written on their webpage that this so-called lava tube hole, or I call it entrance, is about 50 meters wide. This is uh, pretty amazing because look at what NASA is writing on their website about this hole. They are writing that the underground tube is also at least this big. So they expect there to be a 50 meter wide tube underneath the surface of Mars. I think that's amazing because it could be created by lava, but no matter how it was created, it can be used for other purposes like this. So guys, leave a comment in the comment box on YouTube or Facebook. Tell me what you think. Next picture, number two, is from Ricardo Tanori. It's a really great picture and it shows what looks to be a stone building on top of the Martian surface. This is my rendering of, of uh, Ricardo's pictures from Facebook, which I'll leave a link to in the video description so you can see the original. This is great. Uh, I want to have a closer look, so let's zoom in a little bit on it and see if we can see anything else around or nearby, because I think this is an amazing picture. It looks like there is a little doorway on the right side. It looks like there is two smaller windows on the left side, and just about above the windows, it's separated from what would be the ceiling or the roof. I think this is a really, really, really great picture. Could this be the smoking gun on Mars? I'm asking you. Leave a comment in the comment box on YouTube. We got picture number three from Mars Curiosity rover. This is taken by the mass cam camera on the rover. And it, it, it's a weird one because you are looking at a square something. A square frame. Is it a square? A rock and what are those pipes on the right side on it poking out of, of, of the rock or, or the cliff the sand it is a weird one it's from curiosity and it's from uh, it's day number 3397 since it landed on the Martian surface so this is these are some of the later images from curiosity rover which are still good quality what are we looking at here, guys? Please leave a comment in the comment box on YouTube or on Facebook. We got picture number four from Mars Perseverance Rover. I haven't done much work with the Mars Perseverance Rover yet, but this is a, a little beginning. What are we looking at? Are we looking at a satellite dish on the Martian surface? Or oh, is it just shadows playing up? But I would definitely like to hear what you guys out there think about it. Could it be a satellite dish on the Martian surface? I don't know. It's definitely out of place here. This is one of the newer pictures, as you can see. It's from February in 2022. These are some of the pictures from Mars to where I would add the comment. Just think about it. Picture number five. This is a great one, and it's been pointed out by Dolly Indigo Star, who found this disc-shaped object half buried under the sand. It's clearly to see, it's there. I do believe personally that this it's not the original color of the object that NASA have covered it over with surrounding colors to make it match in. But, but this round object, you don't see anything like it in the area around it. So it kind of stands out from everything else in this picture. I do think it's a, a really nice little anomaly we found here that definitely looks like it's artificial shaped almost perfectly round. Just think about it.
We got another good one from the Mars Curiosity rover, taken with the mass cam. And in the middle you can see a round hole. I like this one because I, I like to ask questions uh, to you guys out there, what you guys think we're looking at. Because this one here could be tricky. Is it just a shadow playing? Because we have the sun coming from the back. But to create a round circle like that, you would need some structure above to create the shadow. So I would love to know what you guys think out there. Are we looking at a black shadow or is this a round, perfectly round hole at the end of this rock? Just think about it. And here is one of my absolute favorites. This is also from the Mars Curiosity rover. It's not from the mask hand this time, it's from the Mars hand lens imager, which take close off of our ob ob objects close to the rover. This object here is no more than two centimeters wide. So it's a pretty good resolution. But what are we looking at? Is this the Martian flower? And why did NASA choose to name the page with the link on the Martian flowers. Do they believe it themselves that it is a Martian flower? I posted this one on Facebook and 90% of all the comments says coral. So are we looking at some kind of coral here? I don't know, but I find this picture amazing and it definitely stands out from everything else I've seen so far. Please leave a comment on this one in the comment box on YouTube or on Facebook. This is an amazing one. We got a new one here from Mars Perseverance rover. And this is kind of stunning to me because if you look at the two circles on the right, the top anomaly seems like the shape of it reminds me of some elder Mayan structure. Uh, the way it's shaped and it stands out from the other rocks, it's got these almost perfect angles to it. And there's another little object below it in the sand that stands out with its colors as well. You can see it's more dark, it's more black and, and, and it's more square. Now we can see it again coming back into the frame in the circle on the right side. What is that? On the bottom, it doesn't look like a rock. What is that on the top? Is it artificially shaped and created to get that shape? We got a really, really good one. This one is pointed out by Dolly Indigo Star also. This one deserves attention because I do believe that she is right when she says that that looks like some kind of a mechanical part or a spare part of a kind. Uh, these, this is one of the pictures that has got the most response on Facebook. So it's catching a lot of people's interest. And I understand why, because even I sit here with all my years of experience of anomaly hunting on Mars and looking at this one, I can't figure it out. It do not look natural to me. It does look like some kind of spare parts that are holes with to, so you could tighten it to other stuff or fasten it to other objects. It, it's, it definitely do not look natural. Is this the smoking gun? Another one from Mars Curiosity Rover. A great one because look at the angles of that rock that seems to be leaning up upon the rock on the left side. That does not look like a natural cut. That looks to me like there was some kind of wall or construction there. Half of it is gone now and the only thing left we see is that tiny little part with that 100% perfect 90 degree angle cut in it. And it's not just one, it's one, two, three, four perfectly cut. 90 degree angles. I do not believe nature has created this one, but I would love to hear you guys what you think about this curiosity image. It's been taken on its day 3279 after it landed on the red planet. Amazing picture. 
Here's another one from Mars Perseverance rover. And it's from my its mass camera also. The object in the circle have what looks to me like a blank space on top that does look like a window, like one of them sphere-shaped windows. The object we are looking at is no more than a meter uh, or a meter and a half from, from one end to another of, on, on the top. So it's not a giant object we are looking at. And I am aware that the resolution on, on which this perseverance image that should be perfect uh, and ultra clear is not the best. But I choose to bring it in because I would like to hear your opinion. What do you think we are looking at here? Is it just a rock that looks suspicious? Another good one. I call it the fish. This is from Mars Curiosity Rover. And when you zoom in on that rock, <laughs> I think most of you uh, uh, see the same as I do. This was posted on Facebook as well by several people. And all with the same uh, uh, result, people commenting on it saying it does look like a fish. And I must admit, it does look like a fish. Is this a carving of a fish? <laughs> Could it be? Or is it just natural coincidence? we are looking at here on the Martian surface. And again, please leave your comment on this picture on, in the comment box on YouTube or Facebook. And you can view it on Spacelink TV on Facebook as well also. Here is one of my favorites from the Mars Perseverance rover. That hole in that rock looks too perfect for me. I do not believe that is a shadow. I do believe it is an actual hole in the rock. The question is, who made that hole? And for what reason? Is it an animal who has made it? Is it life on Mars? If you can use that way of saying it, that have made it. I don't know. But I really, really like this one because it stands out and it's clear that's not a shadow, that's a round hole in a rock. So could it be a base, basic ventilation shaft or is it an animal that lives in there? I don't know, I'm asking you. Mars Perseverance Rover has brought us a lot of good pictures lately and this is another one that I choose to bring in today. I'm a little bit 50-50 with this one, but it definitely show uh, in the circle on the left what you see in the distance on the right. And it's a kind of a leveled out area. It doesn't look natural. It looks like uh, it's got windows inside almost like holes, square holes in, in, in a square line. It could be just coincidence. It could be just shadows, all of it. But I do choose to bring this one up today because it looks out of place somehow, somewhere on a planet where there should be no life. And we are getting to the last picture for today. And I brought this one up before and I will keep bringing this one up again because this is my absolute favorite image from the Martian surface. It's a satellite image taken from the Mars Global Surveyor and it's from the year 2000. UFOs on Mars. This anomaly here is 148.5 meters wide. This is not a car-sized object. This is not a bus size or a house size. This one is just as wide as a cruise ship. So this is huge object. And it's so big you can see it clear from the Mars Global Surveyor satellite taken with the Mars Orbiter camera. With this image, I thank you for watching 15 minutes with 15 pictures. Remember to click like, subscribe and get notifications. 
And join us on Facebook. We are on Facebook, Spacelink TV. We also have the group Mars Moon Space, where you can find all the images and all the links to it. Thank you for watching. Until we see you again, take care. You are watching 15 minutes with 15 images from Mars.